Hey guys, so today I thought I would do kind of a first impressions of the Trend Mood subscription. It's not even a subscription box. The Trend Mood box volume three, which had a couple new products. I was most excited for the two new Basha products in there. Uh, it's a caviar lime serum and then a vitamin B serum. And uh, I'm liking both of them, although the Vitamin C with caviar lime has a little bit of fragrance and essential oils in there, which I'm not too excited about. But the vitamin B12 serum, uh, I'm liking that one a little bit more. But I was very excited to try these before they even came out. So I don't know. I, I didn't try out for the other Trend Mood boxes. It's the third volume. I guess there's a fourth one coming soon. But when I saw the new stuff in there, I just had to get my hands on it. So anyway, so far, really enjoying these. I got the box a couple days ago. A lot of people got theirs really early. Uh, the new Glow Recipe Lip Pop, which I'm wearing, it has a little bit of a little bit of color, which is nice, and uh, feels nice hydrating the lips. It has a little bit of a watermelon taste to it, and uh, liking it. I, I would kind of equate the shade to the NARS uh, Afterglow Lip Balm, which I typically wear a lot. So it gives a little bit of color and some hydration, so that's always nice. A couple new palettes from uh, Juvia's Place. The purple one I actually had already ordered from Ulta, so I think I'm going to have to hand that down. And then the berries palette. I'm wearing the violets palette right now, which all purples look really nice in a picture, but then when you're trying to put it on, it's a bit much for purple. I don't know, but I love it. So, and I think they're $14 each, so you can't beat that. Uh, we've got new eye gel uh, patches from Good Molecules. Uh, so they're just... Eye patches, they really do a good job with puffiness. They've got a lot of uh, caffeine in there, so, and some other ingredients which really do a good job kind of shrinking puffiness temporarily that lasts for a good five or six hours. But I, I, caffeine, I don't necessarily love in eye products because it can do a good job kind of helping puffiness, but it can leave your eyes feeling a little bit drier hours later. So I don't know, it's kind of a give and take with it. But so far, enjoying those as well. And then, of course, we've got three new, oh, well, you've got the original Poreless Putty Primer, a matte version, and a luminous version. I haven't tried any of these yet, so I'm going to have to play with these over the next few days. But I've heard the original one was a big dupe for um, the Tatcha Canvas uh, Primer. And I think it's like $3. It's always sold out at Ulta every time I looked at it. So now I finally got all three to try. And they just came out with eye primers versions of these too. So I don't know. I'm going to have to check those out too. So anyway, I just thought I would give my first thoughts on the Trend Mood box da, 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 and the products inside. So I'll definitely be reviewing these uh, after I get a chance to try them out and having so much fun with the Basha. And I picked up a few new other things this week as well. So one thing I'm playing with is the new uh, Versed Baby Cheeks. This just came out and I've only used it a couple times, but so far I really like it. So anyway, stay tuned for more. I'm going to Vegas tomorrow with my dad for a boxing fight. So maybe I'll do a video about that. The cameraman's coming with two. So the three of us, <laughs> I thought I'd mention that. You point at yourself like I forgot. Anyway, I was going to bring my dog with as a therapy dog, but I don't know. Anyway, maybe I should bring the littlest Yorkie Gertie. She would have fun. Anyway, whatever. <laughs> Leave a comment and I will see you more tomorrow. Thank you so much.